Hello everyone, a welcome or a welcome back. I am Arani, and today we're going to be continuing Happy Home Paradise. I saw some excellent villager choices on the beach today, so let's head out and go take a look at that. You obviously know whose um, home I'm doing because of thumbnail and title and whatever else, um, but still news to me. So, I saw Maple and this, and I'm just, I love her so much. Plush bears, a sleigh, fast food. Girl, you weren't, were you out here earlier? I don't know. I don't remember if I saw her or not. Plants. Don't even at me right now, I'll do it. Train. Oh, like, train, not like a train, got it. Cars, appliances, a sleigh. Okay, um, is there anybody else? I am gonna pick up this bottle before I forget. But, I think, adorable and wants plants, let's do it. Let's do it. And don't be angry at me for passing on maple. I adore her, okay? But I'm a plant, I'm a plant bestie, okay? So, and I need to get back into my comfort zone after those last two videos, cause I just, I just need to get back into the groove, if you will. I need to get into it. What was her catchphrase? <laughs> I like those furniture options. Okay. Alright, Norma. Let's go. <sighs> because I get too cozy in these in these um, cozy themes, if you will. So uh, let's go ahead. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and do a two level home since I do one floors a lot so I'm thinking I want to do an actual like layout for her home instead of the usual just like throw plants around I'm thinking I want to do like maybe like a little living room and stuff like that you know and then like her bedrooms upstairs and that type of thing yes ma'am Now question. I'm curious if I can put stuff on that cliff. Let me just... Oh no, that's kind of sad. Darn. Okay. Well, I'll work with what I have.
well. Let me make sure this is accessible. Perfect. Dude, no, I think I did myself here. Seriously, though. No. Alright, let's let's take another freaking picture. Let's take a picture. Let me get out of here. I think it turned out super cute. But yeah. I wanted to make the beach a bit greener. So I used this path that I made. Which I think looks absolutely adorable. And I decided to add a few cactuses too. Because I was like sand. But even though it doesn't match the spring sand. That's okay. But yeah. And I was like she needs some seating. She needs some seating to just sit and enjoy her plants in the ocean. I mean, it's a shame I couldn't fit too many trees. But I did what I could. So let's go in and do the interior. Norma. My liege. Okay, so, I'm thinking, okay, I am thinking with my nog. So for now we'll just make it wider. We may have to do, son of a dingleberry, we have to do more in the future, but I obviously want to give her natural sounds. Okay, so I want... What floors do we have recommend? Literally perfect. Legit. No lying. Okay, we'll do this since like this big flower thingy here matches. So what we're going to do down here is we're going to try and do like... A um... A back garden, but also like a dining room and sitting area. So, we're going to try and achieve that today.
So that's gonna do it for Norma's um, downstairs interior. So let's just go ahead and head up and do her upstairs, which is going to be a cozy little bedroom. Um, we'll do like a full like walkthrough tour thingamajig talk about whenever we finish the upstairs. I think that's gonna do it for Norma's interior. I like, oh, excuse me, let me yawn for a minute. Woo, huh. I really do like how it came out. Um, I don't know, just these colors have been fun to work with, mixing the 
the wheat fields with the cherry blossom piles and and the rugs glow dude i don't know i just i just really really like it it kind of made me sad how i didn't have room for like weeds or like hardly any flowers or anything when i was decorating outside i just got so into it you know but um yeah that'll do it for upstairs and we'll go back downstairs and take a look around but yeah, I think I think our house was super super fun to do. I really really liked doing it. It was very very interestingly eye opening. Uh, ooh, the nature noises. I forgot to add them upstairs. Hold the phone. <laughs> I'm gonna put them up here too. Hold on. But I think we're gonna do a bit more low key, if you will. So like field, so maybe the wind is a little calmer up here. I like it. Ow, I hit my knuckle. Um, but anyway. Yeah, we're gonna make a living, a little living space, and then like, through our backyard, she has a little path to the woods. Obviously you can't really walk very good back there, but, um, but yeah. And I like that I turn off all the lights and let the natural lighting and the lamps kind of take over, you know? Um, yeah, and I wanted to make, like, a nice little cozy living room for her and a nice cozy kitchen. And I, thought, and I was struggling to find a place for the fridge, but I kind of, but I kind of made it work, so, yeah. Yeah, I'll turn it around. I know you can't really see the plants, really from, you know, the other side, but, but if you turn it like this, it's like, oh, okay, plants, but, um, yeah, that'll be all for her home. Montage time. It is ready, my liege. My air conditioning just turned on. Amazing. <laughs> I do that to help me edit. I <laughs> line up the audio. A place packed with plants. I tried. Because I really wanted to put the coffee plant down here. But like, you know, I ran out of space. because I did two floors in here. I think that both turned out pretty good. <sighs> Give me that money, girl. Thank you. Thank you for the cash. Much appreciated. I am finished for the day. Well, everybody, that's going to be it for this video. Um... If you watch to the end, a thank you. Um, if you wouldn't mind to leave a like, maybe subscribe if you want to see more content from me. If you haven't eaten today, now would be a good time to maybe snack on something or get yourself a meal. Um, be sure to drink some water and hydrate. Um, take meds if you need them. Um, if you haven't today, and take care of yourself because you absolutely freaking deserve it. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye!